If you, like me, are still mourning the death of Pluto, I have some good news. There might still be a ninth planet, and we should know for sure whether or not it exists in the next couple years. In early 2025, a brand new telescope is going online in the mountains of Chile. It's called the Vera Rubin Observatory, and its 3200 megapixel camera is the largest on Earth. This new telescope is going to reveal tens of thousands of new objects that are out in the farthest reaches of our solar system. One of those objects maybe could be the mysterious planet Nine. So why do scientists think this planet might exist in the first place? Well, for years they've been baffled by these extreme trans-Neptunian objects, or etnos. Now these etnos have very strange oblong orbits that are very stretched and are tilted off the main axis of the solar system. One reason this might be is because they're tugged by this hidden planet Nine that could be revealed. However, this isn't the only possible explanation for these strangely orbiting objects. It could be that they were tugged off course by a passing star or rogue planet many, many years ago. Perhaps there's a tiny black hole out there that we've never detected. Or perhaps they're not strange at all, and we're only seeing a very small picture of what's out there. There could be a whole bunch of other things that makes these strange objects not so strange. But a favorite explanation for a number of scientists is this mysterious planet Nine, and they hope that Vera Rubin will give us conclusions evidence to prove its existence. One person particularly invested in proving this Planet Nine theory is Mike Brown, the scientist who is infamously credited with the murder of Pluto. If you want to learn more about Planet Nine and whether Mike Brown might get his final redemption, check out today's episode of Science Quickly wherever you get your podcasts or in the you know where.